Hey, this is Brooke Drum with Printabot.com, and I'm pretty excited about our new LEDs. Now, these can be used on the G2 printer board, of course, because that's brand new, and I thought, if I'm going to have everything I ever wanted in a 3D printer, it's going to have RGBW LEDs. So, we put them in the new printer, and then I asked Mick, thank you, Mick, can you make this work with the old printer board? Because there's just an old printer board in this old printer bot. And he said, absolutely, and he did it. Boom! So this is the new me. I can see my prints now, and I know you want this because I'm usually a soft sell, but this one I'm especially excited about because just it's, it's so much better to be able to see what you're printing. So you should get this. But it can do fun stuff too. Imagine if you were heating up and uh, you decided, oh, let's see here, let me put a different color. You thought when it's done heating up, when it reaches a certain temperature, um, you might like it to be red when it's heating up. And when it reaches a certain temperature, let's say, it could tell you that it is, oh, that's blue. <laughs> I want a green. There's green. All right. So you could use color to indicate status. In fact, that's in the little code. It's, uh, we've added M355 and then a space and S1, one, this is state, one for on and zero for off. Then we got color. And so there's, you know, going down the line, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, red, green, blue, white, yellow, magenta, cyan. So it's pretty straightforward. And then after that, you can use brightness and zero to 255. So just a couple of examples. Uh, so these are fading on and off. It's just varying the brightness based on the position. They are extremely bright. So maybe that gets your attention at the end of a print. I have just really had fun playing around with these. I made one that was kind of like a heartbeat. No movements, but just using a wait time. So you can put this in your G code. You can even hack Marlin with it and add statuses to Marlin if you like. But this does work on old printer bots. Of course it works on the new one. Um, it, if you get a G2 board, it'll just plug right in. If you get the legacy board for old bots, um, that you can add on top of the new G2 board, you'll have this plug already. But for those of you that don't want to spend any money, you just want to spend a few bucks on an LED, go for it. It works in Marlin. You can see what you're printing. You don't have to buy anything else. 